Oh, we're back. We gotta pay attention to this story. Thrilling yeah. first person mode. So I like how they put scan lines, but back in the day you still had scan lines on your Wait, TVs. Wait, what the fuck? I don't remember scan lines when we played before. Well, no, this oh, because is, you're, this is vision. Because you're looking through T-1000's eyes. Yeah, exactly. So this is E-102 Gamma, I believe. And uh, he has the most touching story in Sonic Adventure. So where is Ido to know Gamma today? Is he forgotten and thrown into a waste bin? You'll find out very no. succinctly. I mean, like, this yeah. robot has never Did been referenced Toto before. He was in the comments. Into those gibberish syllables. You all right, just all right. You tell me what the robot's <laughs> name is. E102. What? Sorry again. E102. E102. You're not finished. Gamma. You're not finished. Gamma? There! Yeah, See? It. It's hard, isn't it? <laughs> so this is E-102. This uh, is his life. He's got a laser beam to tar target shit. Shooting range is Finally, Sonic has always meant to be what it was. A slow, plodding, robotic adventure. <laughs> I really hope this is just bending girders. <laughs> <laughs> you know, he actually moves at a good clip. Like, he moves faster than Amy and stuff, but... He, does. he moves faster he's... than the other hedgehog? But he's... Yeah, well, Amy What's has Amy her huge again? hammer, that's why. I thought Amy was a poodle. Amy has her huge hammer and diaper. <laughs> so, she has to move... You gotta fill up one of them. that his movement speed is adequate. And we're I, playing a Sonic I thought game. those were legit models. <laughs> I, like, I thought that was them. <laughs> no. God. <laughs> If fucking Easter egg. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, oh, that's great. That's great. That's great. So um, Easter egg fail for not having those models replace the real ones in a secret sheet. Yeah, that'd be a good one. Oh god, and it would look slightly different than the main game. Yeah. This game would be a forty on forty. It already is a forty on forty. What are you talking about? This 40 is one of the few games that Famitsu gave a forty. That's not actually true. Okay, God. <laughs> Jeez, I almost had a heart palpitation, you but then I was like... You fear. Yeah. I believed it. For one second, I sweated more than I've ever had. Yeah. <laughs> and then it instantly dissipated. So the one thing I can say is that this gameplay gets way improved in, in Sonic 2. Yes, because this turns into and, the robot stages the jump with and float uh, and target Tails. Shot and I also thing. like Tails Mecha because it reminds me of the mechs you get in Mega Man, Mega Man X. X. Yeah, yeah. And, and Am I crazy or robot does it turn into armor. High Wind as well? Uh, what does a uh, tails mech? Does it turn into a plane as well, or am I crazy? Uh, I, don't I don't remember, remember it, that. but you, you, you could. It could. Cue everyone screaming at us. Yeah, exactly. I, it's been fucking what a decade. There was a, there was a guy criticizing me for liking the the 1999 comics, and I was like, dude, you're just yelling at seven year old's memories. You're yelling at Babby Liam from yeah, seven exactly. years ago. Fuck. Now it's also true that you love them today, but that's beside the point. That's besides the point. I love I love everyone. Keep posting us terrible comic Sonic covers because the best one is the one where Sonic has a butt has a thick layer of jizz all over his face and it good. says you betrayed me yeah yeah <laughs> and like if the camera pans there's just knuckles oh, like this great unlike you I don't good. chuckle I, I like the idea though of like specifically seven-year-old Liam liking these comics and then getting up to go fucking play with his toys and spill milk all over himself. Yeah, exactly. Like, <laughs> like you're arguing with those tastes. Yeah, the, the true yeah. origin of Liam Milk. Okay, this is this is written very well. I love how he's just walking, walking in his head. Walking. It's kind of startling how well produced E102's story is. I mean, does it make you feel weird where you have to, like, get to the point where you're like, No, I know it's not great, but this story is written really well. <laughs> it's not. He has the best story, but that's not saying much. Like, I get it, man versus machine, and like, you know... Developing a personality. Prometheus? <laughs> but... Mm -hmm. You're never going to beat Beta Gamma. It should be no problem. It'd be really easy to beat an Alpha, which I sometimes think we, we were playing that. <laughs> Amy crawling into the healing pod for self-surgery. <laughs> and then Amy not running sideways from the collapsing vehicle. Mission complete. Oh wow, you aced it. Yeah, well, shouldn't be trouble. Dude, in case you haven't noticed, all the, the rival fights in this game are easy as piss and super underwhelming. Uh, Remember the Knuckles one at the beginning with Sonic? That was also easy as piss. It was just literally just hover above this his head and you win. This isn't that easy when I think about it. It's like incredible. That's why the saying is piss and vinegar. 
Is it? No, because you're filled yeah. with piss and vinegar. Yeah. Because you fight better when you're chock full of piss. Mm. Remember the uh, fighting game players in Toronto said, "Don't go to b go, go go fight." Fight hungry. No, no, but fight not kidney bladders empty. Yeah, but they also fight said better. fight hungry, so I don't believe anything. You fight better when you're about to shit all over oh, yourself. Okay, okay. Fight hungry and shit ready. Because fight or flight ready. lets loose everything, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 So if you're, if you're gonna not flight, then you get ready to fight with shit inside you. Just shit all over. Remember, Mar kids. A fighter. Birds equal scale. So true. Even when you're a fucking Tenkin Topper Gurren Lagann in space. Mm -hmm. Fly <laughs> some birds around. Well, just space birds. Put a bird on it. Put a, yeah, that's literally put a bird on it for video games. Mm -hmm. Especially in concept art. If you're drawing God of War concept art and God knows everyone will always will be for the end of time, just put some birds on Kratos and make his dick look huge. Kratos' forehead is just begging for a bird tattoo. It's kind of what he's made for. I'd rather play Viking Battle of Asgard. We're not playing Viking. Can we just stop the assembly? video? Can no. play Viking? No, E102 is fun. What about simultaneously? Can we get picture in picture on this? Ooh, that'd be a good joke in the future. <laughs> Xbox One, Snap, like uh, Snap, Pornhub, like that match of uh, Fist of the North Pornhub Star that takes place in the casual. World. It's the Jojo only Star app Battle. on the Xbox One that offers porn. Oh, I wouldn't gravitate <laughs> to it either. But that is American tastes. Bang Bros for life. On the Xbox One, you boot it and it says, what do you want? TV, Pornhub, or TV? I didn't say that. How is this the linchpin for the story? <laughs> because he knows. He knows it's secret. Is, yeah. is the frog like Buta? Frog and it has spiral energy? Yeah, Froggy, actually Froggy kinda. Froggy has the, the Chaos Emerald. Froggy thing. has, yeah, I Emerald forgot. So then, yeah, it does the, have spiral energy. The tail energy. is what went into the big Chaos form at the end of the last one. Mm -hmm. Truly, this is the most optimal way to tell a story. Yeah. Yeah. When we were talking about how Big the Cat uh, funds Kickstarters and then, like, backs out and takes everyone's money. Yeah. yeah. I also... I Sends also, them burning into the ground. I also... Wooly has never not stumbled... There's cream, by the way. ...over a line so well that it was way better than ever it could be than... Then Big the Cat has crossified Jesus. <laughs> that was pretty... <laughs> crossified. Pretty crossified is so sick. Crossified, crossified is a bit of a strong word. It feels like a fighting game move from some yeah. forbidden yeah, Chinese yeah. fighting game. Crossifiction. Crossifiction. Yeah. Uh, uh, was that thing, uh, the, the fighting game that has the voice like that? Remember we are talking about what was the fighting game that, uh, like... Tattoo Assassins? Yeah, what was it? <laughs> Perfection. Perfection. Crossfiction. No. What? What's wrong, Willie? Now I do like that we're back at the stage because it's the first time we back into the stage since seven parts ago. Mm -hmm. So I like that. That's I also cool. like how you feel like a Terminator on the stage because you I just walk you through do. shooting everything. So Liam, your method is clearly one of as long as you're holding a single ring, everything is a okay. Everything. Yeah, I don't. It's not right. a forty-two. I don't need so to collect a hundred rings. Does that make you? want to redesign the Sonic ring life system. No, I think the ring life system's good, actually. Maybe having more rings should have an incentive? Because well, you get an extra the, life at 100 the only, rings the only some thing, games. The only thing I would say is, like, if you wanted to do something to that, like, I've thought about it before, obviously, and, like, only thing I would change is like maybe make him go faster the more rings. Which you is have. what that's that's the first thing. Tear I him apart. Oh. But honestly, I think it's it's uh, relatively fine the way it is. Damn it. <laughs> because besides the, the, the oh my god, I'm actually an idiot. Did I skip that? Did you? Did you press a button? No, the frog warped. Okay, in no, here. I think I think we're good. I think we're good. Don't press anything. We can't miss the story. Must determine location. Yeah, no, we're good. Guess where we're at. Must philosophize this is, about this the is, human condition. This is all coming together, man. And when the story delivers, you'll you'll just you'll be in shock. This robot slowly scans. You the will area. be legit shook by the resolution. I am shook. Look at this blast processor. <laughs> you should have a blast processor. It's like totally. One of the slowest games ever in terms of cutscenes. Yeah. But at the time, they were the only cutscenes around. You know that Metal Gear Solid came out before this. That's true. <laughs> Someone just said, do you think, guys know that Metal Gear Solid came out before this? I think this? Metal Gear Solid on the Bleemcast oh. also came out before this. Hey, it's the 
Chow? Cows. Chow. 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 Now, Chow. there's two schools of thought. We did it. There's eight schools one of thought. One school thinks they're called Chow, and the other one thinks they're called Gascoin. <laughs> Matt, you can laugh. <laughs> Matt's stifling his laughter. Wooly's stifling just, his anger. Wooly, think, just think long and hard you have all the time in the world, and get back at him. I'm, I'm, mm. Liam says things like cockroach. Yeah, but that's that's how you say it. No, it's, it's not. because my 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 lips are sealed <laughs> to the truth of the matter, and that's extremely frustrating. A lot of things that incriminate you, you always say my lips are sealed about the truth, mm -hmm. so I can't explain I it. I can't explain it. I'm not allowed to explain it. But trust him. Trust this clinical wire. Now liar I'm really ready for some echidna on robot action. I'm surprised you didn't say Ignita. I thought is, about it. Which is a good pronunciation as well. It's acceptable. It's acceptable in the Sonic lore. These little creatures are annoying and they've ruined the franchise. What you need to do is murder is and chip. put their flesh on That's so that chip, you can blend right. in with these organic beings. Cover yourself in the chow boy. Your shame, Ed209. Wear the flesh. <laughs> you want to just call him Ed 209? I'm calling him Ed 209. Fair. From now on. Fair. Because that's a more compelling character. I, yeah. mm. That he had a pretty, pretty <laughs> great Memorable. arc. Memorable. Yeah. yeah. It was a coming of age tale for Ed. Mm. All the way from you have ten seconds to comply, drop your weapon, to falling down the stairs and to screaming. Falling down the stairs. It was a full character arc. It was almost like I don't boyhood. Understand what's, yeah, it's like with boyhood a with a robot. We filmed this robot for over ten seconds. How come there are no subtitles? Did you catch that dialogue just there? I would have if there were so subtitles. So they're like, this is the frog you want. No, this is the frog you want. That's actually pretty funny. They all have tails. Oh, I hope Robotnik loves me. Or do they? Ah, dummies, 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 dummies! None of you got Strong writing. We must find the frog with chaos That's the right one! It's just clipping into his hand. Well, that's how you know it's the right one. Well, no, hang on. Give it a second. Let him at least look at what E102 has. Okay, sorry. Because E102 what? came in late, remember? Just the cutscene wasn't animated. That's, that's <laughs> that's I, was like, I was like, okay, because for a minute it's like plot reasons dictate that you can't see it because it's inside his hand. No, like, you totally got it. I like how your own ineptitude on cutscenes is what stifles the story sometimes. Like bit. in this. Like you go, wait, that's wrong. And you're like, wait, no, the cutscene needs another 47 seconds oh, to get to where no. your mind already is. Brother. That's actually super harsh of robot. Decimated. A new assignment. This one's easy. Go fishing! You fucker! Capture Big the Cat! Fish for him! Crossify him! Sacrifice Big for more time on the clock! Just get me that bird! Now, go! You can say anything and, and say sacrifice it for more time on the clock and, it works and laugh. every time. Go get the bird. Sacrifice big for more time on your porn clock. It's a porn clock. You'll know. <laughs> it's just amazing how much downtime there is between every oh, cutscene. Yeah, yeah, no, this game has an absurd and almost insulting amount of empty cutscenes. It's where it's, just nothing's going on. Dare I waiting. say, thirty percent is actual content. I'd say like twenty. Uh, yeah, I'd say like 30, well, 40 that's percent. Like Thirteen seconds right now. Fourteen seconds of nothing. Like, usually when we watch a cutscene where it lingers way too long on things, I go, yes, and... Yeah, but this is the and, entire and games, game. games do it occasionally. Even modern mm -hmm. games do it, especially when there's flybys of... Yeah, but they've gotten, go. they've gotten better. But this is, like, all of it. Mm -hmm. um, like, this cutscene's fine, because it's relevant. They're making HK. But... Yep. Well, the, that's but the why sound does every character rate, have to so... walk in place? That's just... That's it's just mistakes. It's, that's the engine, man. But you can make them stop by but just you, pressing you, a button. You, you, but, you know... <laughs> if you mash the M key on your keyboard, Sonic developers, they'll stop doing their walk cycle. Do it Exa again. That's what exactly. Start point, end point, walk cycle in between. This is the wrong room. <laughs> <laughs> well said, Ed209. But now you're stuck in here and have to do a level, so... I felt the drama in that scene. It was incredibly well written. So this was that uh, minigame with... Uh, Amy, if you remember, and it saves your score from Amy's story. 
That's that's pretty cool. Oh, it's does it? Yeah, it's nifty. We should put up a poll of what Sonic game to play next. We already a... decided on one earlier. No, we, we didn't full troop because Wooly wasn't here. But we kind of did. But we should still actually put up a poll. Do you think that's a good idea? Yeah. If we choose which ones we're going to put in the poll, yes, it's fine. <laughs> okay. Because I was talking to Liam, I was like, I don't know which one to do. Because this one's been like... A growing grabbingly great success. Mm -hmm. Well, let's let it end first. No, we're still in it right now. Wait, no. wait, wait, wait. We'll extend. Shut it up. Forever. We might get an Amy O face. I've been needing one recently. I want to know why you. I thought you lived with your girlfriend. Nah, she, she doesn't have pink hair anymore though. Oh. You don't even know. <laughs> that could be one. What even? Yes, because robots have the capacity. Why not help us out? It's not that they have the capacity to be mean, it's that they don't have the capacity to be sympathetic. There you go. And so, yes. de facto, they oh, seem mean. Oh, fucking Liam School. Unless super they hard. learn. Which... If he has a neural net processor. Which Ed 209 with his neural net not. processor A learning do. computer. His jostling, jiggling processor. Well, we need to find out if the writers are fans of Asimov. Mm -hmm. Robot doesn't care. Zach, I love you, but you shouldn't be walking all over the fucking cables right now. I don't That's like a really when Zach dangerous walks cable, near the Zach. recording gear. Zach, your supple butthole is about to <laughs> unplug the microphone. It's responding no, aggressively no. to the laser. You see, a clumsy dog like some horrible rat creature like Benny would trip all over and slobber on it. I'm sure Max has lost hundreds of hours of footage to Benny. Huh? Hundreds of hours. <laughs> Thousands, even. <laughs> All right. Yep. I have understood the feelings <laughs> you have described. Because he watched his buddies get killed, so he knows loss. Mm -hmm. it is here. Take this. <laughs> you can hear that sick music again. <laughs> You're different. Defective. Put on a fedora and I'll date you. Aren't you? I guess we can be friends then. Take care, okay? Yeah, just walk in. Walk back into your cell, because that's the direction she was going into. Yeah, yeah, and they changed it. You have disobeyed and freed the prisoner. Now what? Shouldn't Robotnik have cameras all over? He should, but he probably doesn't. Forget No, nah, he probably never thought this just would happen. Just have logs of direct feeds of his thought fed yeah. to a fucking yeah. hard drive somewhere and just straight up see what his actions are. I okay, bet now you we get the jet booster. Back in the day, like this was what came out in 99, right? 98 or 99. 98 yeah. in Japan, maybe? Um, um, yeah, one, one of the two. I'm not 100% sure. But uh, Robotnik... 9999. 9999. Robotnik would go, Oh, I can put this on my hard drive. Featuring over a gig of data. Yeah. <laughs> Me and Liam were playing something recently. We're like, yeah, back in like. It was. uh... Don't say what it is. I no, but I'm actually struggling to remember. <laughs> Don't say what it is. Forget where the exit is. This is great. This is great. It's pretty good. There it is. This is maybe the exit. Uh oh. Uh oh. Liam, is this gonna be okay? It's gonna be okay. Okay, you didn't you didn't get your run through on this one. It's gonna be okay. Okay, it's gonna be okay. All right. The exit to paradise. Gotta find it. Gotta <laughs> find it. That is something that Ed Two Hundred Nine would what say. What is E One Hundred Two fighting for? I feel there like we I'm go. looking say at it a right. future it's Ed version 209. of myself. Fast cars. Have you hot seen babes? Have you seen <laughs> Looper? Here's the jet booster. Press and hold the jump button, and you'll float for a while. So uh, this is this makes well, his well, gameplay work a lot better. Well, all robots should have a hover. Yeah, exactly. That's kind of why it's so much better. Nice! Perfect, 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 perfect. Ceiling collision is a bad idea anyway. Who would want it? Who would need that? Just go through the ceiling. I mean, <laughs> come on. Real life has no ceiling collision. You just can't tell because it's too high. It's yeah, too exactly. High. If you could touch your ceiling, you'd find out. But nobody will never know. Nobody can touch their ceiling. True facts, true facts. I wonder if Pat has ever touched the ceiling. Remember when he stacked those two ladders together and still couldn't? And still couldn't, yeah. 
He tried really hard. Embarrassing. Uh, that was the day we found out Pat doesn't know how to operate a ladder or a hammer. Oh Pat's, my god, that the, hammer thing! Pat's gonna so die by falling out of world. <laughs> we'll just clip through the corner of his apartment, and that'll be it. You remember uh, this? It's all sinking. No, I don't. This is where uh, you fight E102 as Sonic, and the fight lasts oh, three seconds. Sure. So shouldn't you lose this? Uh, yeah, I should. I won't, but I should. <laughs> It's the same in Knuckles' story, where Knuckles beats Sonic, where he should be losing. No, that's just no block like, yeah, and it's, like, yeah. it's it's fighting game arcade mode story. Well, yeah, the, yeah, the, yeah. the idea is they draw. The player and they, character. And neither one story. wins, they just pull away. Well, then no one gets over. No one. <laughs> <laughs> See, that's where, stupid. Where's the game that demands that you lose on purpose? That's what I want to know. Now, I know it's nice to get versatility and have someone kind of on Botnik's side. Why would Robotnik have a minion that runs on rings? It just seemed like the right thing to do at the time. After so many years of chasing Sonic, I guess you think that rings cute. are a good thing? Well, yeah, cute, yeah, Look, yeah. cute animals were great fuel, but mm. it, they piss off Sonic, so he, he had to stop running them on that. Come on, give me the face! That might have been one. No, no, no. Because the idea of Robotnik creating an engine and just shoving as many tiny animals and squirrels into it and having it process the ultimate, ultimate fuel resource right. mm -hmm. is amazing. Kiss him! Make out with him! Make Song jealous! Make out with the gun! <laughs> Make out, just get your face all up in there! Yeah, that's the way. He's lowering the gun, but he's actually pointing it at her. At her, yeah. <laughs> right at her, right at her paunch. Oh no, something. Sonic, look, the air carrier. Liam, is it gonna be okay? It's gonna be okay. All right. It's gonna be okay. All right. It's you have going no all right. faith in it's me. Going all right. What would you do, Sonic? I'll nail Eggman. I'll crossify him. Slam on him. You can't stop me from crossifying. I learned from my friend Big. Hate that guy. Yeah, whatever Sonic says as he goes off in the distance and forgets about Amy. You see the clips of of uh, Small the Cat, the the evil Big the Cat. Oh, in the uh, in the, the in the comic arc with Scourge as the main character, right? Oh, is that what that is? is I'm, I'm pretty sure. I, I have I have a JPEG, Leo. It's Scourge. So I don't know. Yeah, with a green hedgehog, right? Okay. That's I believe his name is Scourge. I have I have one volume of that. It's not bad. <laughs> I'll lend it to you. Um, in the Archie it's, Double Digest. It's too late. I already put it in your apartment. It's mm. already been seated. So under I have your a couch. problem with tails. Just just fucking slid across the ground, but his tails weren't rotating at all. They're still not rotating at all. He's just hovering. <laughs> it's, it, the tails are just for show, really. No, but in Sonic 2, the legit yeah. Sonic, like, his tails fucking rotated the shit. Yeah, no, the truth is that he has an anti-gravity asshole. But mm, he spins compelling. the tails to make people think You've it's been just... working in your workshop a long time on that. <laughs> no, actually. Uh, just, you know. You know, you're like, I, I busted that out in a night. I, I really just, it's... You know, oh! He's memories. thinking... Memories. memories. He's thinking of memories. They killed my brothers. He's making that strong robot. I have to kill him. That hedgehog girl's really cute. Not kill them all. Enemy. Dr. Robotnik Enemy. is a poor programmer. So do they like Isaac Asimov, Wooly? Friends. Hold on. Depends on whether or not he can break the rules. You're right, he has to actually do it. You're right. Amy said maybe five sentences to him, and that automatically makes her his friend. Mm -hmm. Well, look, just because you have AI doesn't mean you have good judgment. <laughs> take this fucking boat. <laughs> you can hover! No, take the fucking tiny boat back to the egg carrier. I will use this ancient caveman technology. You have ten seconds to comply. Imagine Ed 209 inside felt really bad shooting that businessman. Dude, you I know it, some... I, but I internally, know, he had tears. Yeah, and, and he had to suffer through it. I know some shit about Skynet. Because you saw that book that was over there, the, the Terminator book, and you looked for it yeah, for a second? Yeah, I thought I found some shit about Skynet that will blow your fucking mind. Go on. I, I can't say it here. Gotta save it. Oh, oh. okay. 
Story but I really want to know. Just, well, I'll tell you. Just off, putting it out there. Uh, sorry, Are everyone. I'll have to week? tell them off like, camera. What week? What are you talking about? I don't understand, Willie. You're well, stupid. The one that the dumb. lake spoiled. Wow. Oh, I didn't know that. <laughs> To not, you not, or to everyone? No, he was he was uh, he was uh, drawing some stuff and streaming it. So wow, no one saw that. It was pretty though. obvious what it was. No one saw it though. <laughs> it's okay. So it's fine. It's all right. <laughs> uh, oh shit! It's not here yet. I opened the Eggman door early. I love how the password to that door is like the most obvious Eggman. It's like butt? you could never fuck it up. Right, but <clears throat> there we it's go. Butt sex. Robots have no use for butt sex. That's not true. Well, You've whatever. never been embedded with a robot. There's that panel. Enemies in a wide pattern. That hatch. The one that you screw off. It takes some getting. It get, takes a while, but once you're there, you don't leave. Samus knows what's up. Samus has the hatch. What's happening? So I got the death laser. The death laser lets you win. Is it actually called that? Or is it just called laser? No, it's the um. Laser, laser blaster or something lame. No, it's the laser blaster. It's cool. I don't know. Seems like it's not. Ah, uh, this way. I don't, I don't really get the level progression of this chapter at all. Well, right now I'm going back to the boat to get back to the. Because you were here and I left. Because you have to let the boat crash so that you can get the laser blaster. Okay. Why would you ever not be using your wheels? Because I haven't been running far enough yet. But as a robot, I know. Yeah, no, you're right. You're right. Just use your wheels at all times. No, he should wheels. be moving them. The only thing I can think is like, for like accurate, low, like small distance movement, you wouldn't want to go max speed. No, that's stupid. That being said, like the robot should always be able to. Oh my fucking god! Go. Are you serious? Well, what did you expect? Hover! <laughs> <laughs> Am I nuts? No. So now we go. Oh, so, okay. So I kind of. I'm sorry I freaked out there. I thought you were going to have to wait all the way up that no, fucking no, ladder. No, no, no. You skipped it. Because that was ridiculous. Wheel up the stairs. Once again, you interrupted us already discussing him using feet instead of wheels it's everywhere true. at all times. You're right. Uh, steal the wind crystal. But that's from the tails. thing. One of, one of the biggest game design problems that Me most developers grapple design. with. No, no, just in games is when you go up a ladder, how fast you make it. Yeah. If you make it too slow, a player will return the game and get his money back like Pat. Or if you have it too fast, people go, well, that's unrealistic, and then they'll return the game like I, Pat. I think a good balance is like a, a decent pace, but the ability to jump up the ladder, like, and you can just match the jump. I don't know any games exactly. that let you jump up the oh, ladder. Oh, there, oh, uh, God, I definitely I know games don't. that let you jump up, like, a rock face. Uh, like a Prince of Persia game, but a Like ladder? Uncharted and stuff. Tomb Raider. Yeah. Which Tomb Raider? All of them? The recent one. one. Yeah, it's um, been a while. And, Destroy uh, your brother. Yep. Why? To, to delete the emotions Amazing. that you've learned. You can salvage it, though. Great texture. You can get, you can get, you can go. Everyone uh, give Ed 209. No, there's an invisible wall. I think I lost it. I no, lost no, it. it's fine, though. It was almost there. He's a fighter. Don't it's, give up. Oh, it's aged oh. well. <laughs> I never said that. I've no, only said I never it's aged said, poorly. I never, but I never said you said that. I know. I'm you're right. That. You're right. I want, like, yeah. towards the end of his arc, Ed 209 learns how to blush. It's coming. It's coming. He's working on it. I wonder what we have to do here. I. It's a puzzle. You have to solve solve for X. I miss Tails sections from Sonic Adventure too. Because like I have a theory <laughs> that if you just if you give him some big cute eyes, he like, stops look menacing and he doesn't look menacing. This, this game. Even look this game would have now. saved the Dreamcast anyway. in Japan if he would have had big cute eyes. Little like Japanese woman can't fight robots with big cute eyes. Oh. That's what? the real battle. That's the real fight. It's like that, you ever see that little video of like, the kid who has a Spider-Man pinata? And, and then like, it flies give... into the air and he's like, Nande. No, no, no. None day. <laughs> they give him, they give him a, a stick to beat the pinata for the candy. And he's like, he starts tapping him softly three times, but he can't do it because it's Spider-Man. Oh. So he just puts the stick down and he goes yeah, and he hugs him. Yeah, why would you make a pinata something a kid would love? It was a terrible idea. That's and the kid awesome. just hugs the pinata and goes, no. Like, have the kid beat, like, some characters from Frozen or something. Yeah, well, his parents were cold, <laughs> unfeeling assholes. 
Like when it's your parents got you the Punisher piñata and you couldn't do it. No such thing. It's, not, it's not his fault his parents were Dothraki. Oh, like, <laughs> like there's Ninja Turtle piñatas. I had a store the other day that had candy and then Ninja Turtle piñatas. Why the hell would you want to beat up anyone but Donatello? Mm -hmm. but oh, wait, it's what about fine. Leonardo? It's fine because Donatello's dead, so... Ah! Like, it's, it's so easy Dude, you that it's nothing at this point. Like, you're, you're just going to get a rise for yeah. free every time. You, you got to work a little harder than that, Matt. I, I don't think I need to work harder when he's fucking dead. <laughs> I mean, anyway. All right. <laughs> it's okay, Willie. You had your mourning period for him. Didn't this happen that was before? Already open. It was already Well, no, because remember, these all take all the stories take place in parallel. Remember? But, but as other characters, you blew in up parallel. that same mountain, so it doesn't Ossicars. matter. Unless it's not the same mountain, it's just in another it's, area. No, it's the same one. It's at the same time. The just story at that time in the story, he's at, he's at Windy <laughs> Valley. It actually all works out. Kind of. I think if you look back at the footage, it works out not at all. I'm not saying you're wrong, but there's a high probability you are. Look at this video game. Look <laughs> at how amazing this game solid. is. That's a contender. How can you not like this? Just take that <laughs> clip. Just take that clip and write the word contender in flashing it, letters yeah. right there. I think I can run on this wall too if I, I start do your best. I, I have Getting to start. I have it. to start rolling though. <laughs> what? <laughs> Just roll over the wall. Well, how come that didn't do anything? How come it didn't stop you? <laughs> It's the locker room. Why was I programmed to clip through everything? The singers uh, in the background are like, what? Hey, oh, oh, hey, oh, hey, come on. Because kayfabe, when there's music, cool music for a stage, is there someone outside of the camera <laughs> yeah, that is si that it's singing and that, that, serenading the main character? Yeah, totally. After two hours of not finding the goal, it's like, go over there! Go over the there! The is right there! <laughs> Now that's a good way to do tutorials. It's it weaves you into the game. Just do it in song, yeah. Like in any given like Batman Arkham game, when there's sixteen different prompts on screen telling you a bit of information. What if there was a music that's like, yeah, go over there. Yeah, through the batarang. Shh, you're missing the TJ combo soundtrack. Oh yeah, you could have done that too. Imagine you're playing a fighting game, the lyrics are like, no man, don't block, block, no, don't, don't do it. Oh shit. <laughs> well, and it's like telling you what buttons to press to combo. I don't know, it looks like he's doing a lot of medium breakers, man. Yeah, yeah. You probably can't break that shit. Don't punch, low kick, don't forget What's to up throw. with this funky awesome <laughs> track all of a sudden? I don't remember this before. Yeah, well, we were here before, so... Yeah, because I, I don't drunk. know what to say. It's probably, you know what? It was probably because you were drunk on the blue stuff. Yeah, on the blue stuff. Just fill a blue, blue and, and Pringles. Blue is the best color. Therefore blue and potato paste. Potato paste. So everyone out there, Liam made up some story about potato I paste. I was saying I'm not super fond of Pringles because the texture is not great because you can tell it's just potato paste. Yeah, they're too perfect. They're not cuts. Yeah. It's just potato paste, and Matt's you like, you're lying. No one can cut a potato that precisely. Uh, Ed209 could. Robots can, which is what they use. Uh, robots aren't real, Matt. And, uh, but assembly the, line robots I don't, are totally my, real. I don't doubt the ability of the robot. I doubt the perfection of the potato. Ooh, that's- I hadn't even thought of that. Well, that's to your detriment. I have severe Potato doubts. Potato doubter. You're I gonna, have severe doubts. Well, you're gonna have a lot of shocks in your life from then on. <laughs> from then on. From then on. <laughs> your concept Willie of time received is a awesome. grim reminder. <laughs> <laughs> on that day, Willie received a grim reminder that potato face is not real. You know, like there are perfect potatoes out there, but they're on Instagram because people go, "Holy shit!" There aren't enough. Look at this potato. perfect potato. There aren't enough to make a full can of Pringles. That's what I'm saying. Once you pop. Why do you have to kill them again? They're already died. Or did did, did Robotnik kill them? He just teleported them around. I, I guess he just teleported them away. We already know that's fine. that Pringles' original goal was to be a tennis ball company. Really? Yeah. The oh, balls. I didn't know but that. But they're just you know like when they ordered all the balls the day that they opened up, a bunch of potatoes showed up, and they're like, well... No, they mixed up an order. They ordered tennis balls, the potatoes showed that's up. That's what I mean, you know, but they're pretty late back. Oh, but put this motherfucker with the mustache on the can and fucking call it a day. Are you telling the truth? I can't tell. They're pretty laid back people, so they just said, you know what, fuck it, cut them up. Are you and lying to me? That's how we got Pringles, Pringles, man. Are you serious? That's how it happened. Are you specific? That's how it happened. For real? That's awesome. Pringles is super chill. 
That's cool. Now, I still don't like Pringles all that much. Go check out, go check it out. CEO Mitch Hedberg, inventor of Pringles. Actually, remember you're talking to, be a to a tennis liar. Ball company. Yeah, it's true. So he would know. E101 Beta location. Is Alpha even going to be a thing? What about Epsilon? We will see, won't we? I like Epsilon. Epsilon is really underused. It really is, and and so is Theta, which is why. Oh I, yeah. I like Mech Warrior too because he Theta uses is the all ultimate of forgotten Greek letter. He uses all it's of them. It's not man. actually, but. No, Omega is fucking oversaturated. Yeah. It's tired, and no one thinks about Theta. Especially when you go. <laughs> Omega Redo. <laughs> Yeah, someone, someone play has a theta question. Oh, Next man. time they have a, mm -hmm. an early battlefield thing, they should call it a theta build. Mm -hmm. So then I'll trust them. Someone asked a question, and, and it was, uh, was Omega Red a jobber, or did he do work? <laughs> um, and uh, when I think about it, I feel like every comic I've ever read with him was like a two- or three-parter, where it starts with him doing work, but then he jobs in the end. The, the Wolverine comic that I had, I'm not sure it was the first appearance of Omega Red, but it was certainly like the second or, or early on. Where they're like, Omega Red can't work unless you feed him this shit. Like, he needed something, therefore you are a jobber by default. If you're not automatically, you can just get up and just go, Yeah. then you're you're pretty garbage. Well, Bane mm -hmm. was not a jobber, but when you took the Venom away... He certainly yeah, was. Yeah, but he had the he surplus went to power either, yeah. But it was a bunch of other villains, like Lady Deathstrike and other people that are like, we gotta feed this into Mega Red, then he'll beat the shit out of Wolverine. Wolverine and Maverick and whoever teamed up. But Omega Red's power, um, death factor, That's was fuck really you. good. Not death factor. It was death factor. You wish you had death factor. No, I don't believe you. We're back to the start. Yeah, Take it away. Level. The oh, name's shit. Ed 209, Bartholomew oh, J. Shit. That's Bart with an R. Oh, and that. the capital T. Simp plus S O N. That's me. I didn't what, Willie? Are we supposed to do this again? Nope. Okay. No. This is a total botch. Because I'm supposed to come here, because the level's in the same place, but just not that door. I went in the wrong it's door. It's cool. We get to see that Sonic again. Mission the true Sonic. And that's a okay. You get to kill those emeralds. The Sonic that was always born to be. Straight out of Yuji Naka's butthole. Into Just our hearts. Scraping the stains off of his underwear. When Yuji Naka made the character, he was like, I can't wait for him to be ruined. Then I, 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 and only then shall I unveil my true masterpiece, Ivy the Kiwi. Like, why is- why is a stain on your underwear nastier than the actual direct pro product? <laughs> I don't know. It's like- it's like the refuse. <laughs> because... Why didn't you clean... Your, your- the stain? Like, why- why? Yeah, you just, you left it alone. Why is that, it like That this, shows Eugene? laziness. I Did I ever tell you guys about Jab Jabs? No? You mean Lord Jabu Jabu? No, Jab Jabs from Grenada. No. No, you did not, sir. <laughs> okay. So, every year, there's Carnival, right? Carnival. 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 And, uh... And fuck this, I did it so well a thing, the There's a thing, well, you gave up in the end, remember? Didn't I get it? No, you gave up. Oh. Now you got it. Unlike Sick. his hero, Liam always gives up. Are you serious? <laughs> was I not supposed to even go this way? That's where a Chaos Emerald was? Oh my know. god, that's probably where an emblem is for another character. Um... Figure it so out. So there's these dudes, I'm, right? I'm working on it. Whoever wants to, goes out into the field, strips down into like, like, basically like loincloth or like pants, whatever, gets almost as naked as possible, and you just rub the blackest oil all over you. Like, uh -huh. you uh, dump yourself in it. I'm down, it. I'm down. And what is the point of this? And then you this? put on like eco horns, you put on like a helmet horn thing, and you and you you're a jab jab, and your whole thing is to run through the carnival, mm -hmm. uh, 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 like spreading oil on people and ruining their clothes. Yeah, because you're evil. Anyway, that's the peak of Grenadian culture. <laughs> you should finish every Grenada story off by saying that. This is like Metal Gear Solid Three. E series data. Beginning search. Ah. What? This seems like the wrong song. Why are there six dotted ellipses? I don't like that. E 
I can only I, be I hate, incorrect. I hate seeing people on the internet type like four ellipses. It's so like fucking that. frustrating. It's three and ellipses is three. I, I forgot what other video it was, but I already complained about my mom not understanding that like eight million ellipses is not just a brief pause. Are you serious? She types with tons of ellipses and tons of exclamation marks. And when I call and go, is everything okay? <laughs> and she's like, yeah, no, what's the problem? And she just doesn't understand the that volume. You, that she put forty ellipses there, which or is question death. marks, like That's like like, like when playing. I when I didn't return her call right away, and she's like, and she and she. Goes, what's going on? Question mark fucking times ten. That's oh, like if you're that's, playing that's her. Important now. You that's need like to if know. you're playing her an online chess or something. And she's like, good game. Mm, and yeah, it's sixty yeah, exclamation yeah. points. Like, mom, are you alright? Yeah, it's fine. It's alright. No all right. concept of uh, volume. He was just going through the floor. I seen it. That's what they do. But how? Why is the collision so bad? You got to appreciate though the professional exclamation mark. It's like the single one you use to denote excitement working on a product. A yeah. Product. yeah. No, exactly. Like, I'm working on what, Viking what it was Battle made for Asgard. For. Were they excited to work on that? Probably. Yeah. Um, I'm just going to go and straight and say it. The problem, like, the actual moment where the Sonic series got, like, kind of, you know, fucked up, or not fucked up, but... Where, like, it went off the rails is that there was no Sonic game on the Saturn. Now, if um, there was a Sonic yeah, game on the it, Saturn... Uh, Extreme, right, was um, supposed to come out, and that just Extreme never... Extreme was going to be made by, like, a bunch of, like, American... Like, Americans? Uh, or, or, or something. something. But that anyway, was supposed to be the one, if, yeah. Uh, if Sonic R? Sonic R was also made really by a bunch uh, of Americans. It's kind of a spin-off game. That's but like it's saying... Still a but that's like it's saying Mean game. Bean Machine is a Sonic game. That's like yeah. saying well, Sonic Spinball. No, but it, it's not nothing. I mean, but it's a but racing like it's, spin -off. It's, it's, it's the DDR Mario nice. mix of Mario games. Yeah, you know, like I, I guess a mainline like, Sonic game. I just dude. I feel like there was a Sonic game on every Sega console. Well, but Sonic not R's a real really. one on the Saturn. Like Sonic you're, you're, not are, really. Are, a Sonic are you game, saying dude. that if all right, all right. a Nintendo system had a Mario Kart? And that's it? That would have a Mario game? I mean, I mean, some people say Mario Sunshine doesn't count, but I'm like... Oh, which is, Mario which Sunshine is shit. That one totally it, It's counts. a Mario game. Yeah. It's not the best one, but it counts. No, that one, I don't... People saying that are just bitter. The retro levels were great. Yeah. But the fact that there was no Sonic Team Sonic game on the Saturn... That was a big miss. Like, made this probably more janky than it is. If they had gotten a first go on 3D, except for this being yeah, the first one, could you imagine? this probably would have been way, 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 okay, way I've better. I've got a sneaking suspicion that um, memories are just being shit right now, because I feel like there must have been something. No, there, there wasn't. was not. Right. There was Sonic Ex Extreme, right? That was the one that, that never was came to, out. But that never came that out. That turned into Lost Worlds or whatever. No. Uh, the ideas are similar in Lost World, but it's not like... It was made by... Was Sonic made by R was like right. some weird thing. A Traveler's Tales... Was no, it Traveler's Tales? It was Traveler's Tales made Sonic 3D Blast Fuck. or something. Yeah, Sonic 3D Blast, and I think they also worked on the That Sonic was ported R. to the Saturn, wasn't it? I think, yeah. I th I think or maybe the 32X. The Saturn. Or th yeah, it might have been the 32X. I was talking to Liam about this before. The, the Sega oh. CD has a certain place in history, and it has some stuff, mm -hmm. but the actual embarrassing thing is the 32X, because the 32X is nothing. There's so little on the 32X. Because Sonic CD is a pretty good Sonic game. Sonic but, CD, Snatcher, but, but Booger 30, Man. But 32X, like Sonic Chaotix, That's Sonic Chaotix could have been on the Sega CD. There was nothing going on there that required it. Mm -hmm. Like the, the 32X, if there is something worth playing on it, I don't know of it. It's a fighting game that you have yet to discover. Um, Look at all that cute animal stack at the bottom. That's I guess great. Virtual Fighter, but why wouldn't you just play that on the Saturn? Yeah. Or the oh, PC. Oh, yeah. That's what I want. Yeah. That's the ones you want. Perfect. At, at least we're in a, like, cool, fast-paced level, I guess. Instead this of level's all right. It, it's along. different, like waiting for the trains to speed up and slow down and stuff. But the 32X is worth it simply for the stacking. Yeah. You, you simply for the aesthetic ugliness? No, because you can make the infinity machines. You simply get, for you the get aesthetic the Sonic ugliness. and Knuckles, you get the 32X. You get your game genies in there. You fucking stack that shit. I remember that, that like, midget guy in the commercial Pat? for... No, the other one. The, uh, the one for the, the commercial for uh, Sonic and Knuckles. 
And he goes up to Sam and he's like, Hey man, we got a new Sonic game. And he uses new technology. Lock on technology. Lock on and technology. slaps the, the, the cartridges together and Santa's like, this is fucking stupid. The lock on technology is fascinating, but like, it's weird for sure. <laughs> but isn't it so neat? Like, because it was DLC. Basically. And it was, like, that's what good DLC should be anyway, like giant campaigns and stuff like that anyway. Well, okay, that, I thought you were gonna say, we need to stack CDs on top of the if, Blu-rays. If I could do that, I would. That's what Street Fighter should have had. Yeah. Lock on technology? You're not even wrong. You take wrong. World Warrior and lock it onto a cheaper cart. Not even super. wrong. At not first I thought wrong. you were stupid, but then it turned out you are incredibly smart and savvy. It would have been <laughs> hype as fuck. You're totally right. And just have a stack of like six games of all the Street Fighter 2 mm -hmm. Look, it's a Dreamcast. Do you see the little Dreamcast on the side? I did, unfortunately. That's awesome. On. <laughs> if they're good enough to power virtual on robots, yep, they're good they're enough to power true. these. Uh, guys. Epsilon. I, forgot. I forgot about it. I can't remember. Is this Epsilon? So this is like an virtual abomination voice. one. You see it? It's got the head on top and shit. Yeah. So I have to kill it. It's a mercy kill. So what do you guys wow. think the, the connection is between Big the Cat and um, Blaze the Cat? I thought you were gonna say 911. Uh, Blaze the Cat is awesome, and Big the Cat. Oh, is that would horrible. be the that would be uh, the birth of of. Rainbow Dash in Pan's pregnant stomach. Yeah, exactly. I thought you said Pat's pregnant stomach. That too. You can swap. They're interchangeable, really. There's a certain artist out there that's already He's on. Already on. He knows his shit. Named Bob. E105 Zeta. Rescue complete. So yeah, I love that even, even in a stage where the fucking floor is moving at a mile a minute, like the characters then become stationary. Mm. Just as God intended. Just as the great Sonic 2 in the sky. <laughs> People started sending uh, me... Like, I wish, like I the wish they were histories and documentaries. We know it. We know and it. And I haven't watched any of them, and I'm not sure if I should. I've, should. I've been through the whole wiki. It's totally worth your time. Because yeah. last time you guys I've said it's not worth my too. time. No, you didn't want to tell me what he was. No, no, but now you should, because I feel that Wooly is due for a being broke down to the level of a baby. And oh, being it's not that built bad. back up. You haven't had one of those in a while. Is it that bad? It's yeah, not, no, it's, it's not pretty that bad. bad. It's pretty bad. It's, it's not bad. that bad. I mean, well, what's worse? That he could look up right now. Pain Olympics. Pain Olympics is pretty bad. I've been through the Pain yeah, Olympics. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's like that's nothing. No, away. that's nothing. That's actual, like, gross whatever stuff. Like, if this Sonic Chew thing is cringe, Gamma. I'm way more susceptible to the cringe, cringe yeah, than I am yeah, to, no, like, yeah. actual gore. That's Wooly's weak point. One of his many weak points. Like, cringe will make me... Yo, that robot's cool! I cringe know. will put me on the floor face first and just have me rolling. Like, I can't deal with maximum cringe. <laughs> I think you'd enjoy it. I think you'd find it was a good read. I think you'd enjoy it, he says. Yep. Da -na, da -na. Use your wheels. Is, is it, is it totally cringe? Right. Is that is it? it at certain bits. Okay. It's more just like, oh my god, there's a person like this who exists. Project From, from the people nine. who brought you uh, Parking Lot Kingdom Hearts. <laughs> if only. And Lord of the Rings speech in if, the middle if, of an exam room. If only those really? two things could oh, be tied together. I that, one. <laughs> that one's a good one. That one's a good one. Which Lord of the Rings speech? You see him deflecting oh, my fucking... Oh god, oh god, it's so Shut bad. up, shut up. Which, so which Lord of the Rings speech? Uh, the fucking whatever, Aragorn, you see them out there, we're over here for Frodo. Yeah. No, the speech. Wow, okay. What I don't know. No, what the, no, it, that's there's the multiple speech. speeches. There's that's, Gandalf that's... speeches, there's Theodore okay, speeches. Okay, no, the speech. The, okay. the Aragorn thing. Like, some dude goes into a classroom during an, during an exam and just starts going into it, hoping that everyone's gonna get it and just be like, yeah, man, and you're a cool guy. It. And it, okay. everyone just fucking sandbags Sandbag, him. Stonewall. To the okay. point where he finishes it all the way through and just ducks out. And he knows. Because I've avoided talking about something for a while, but I might as well just let it loose right now because it's very similar to this story. Matt was the one in that. I was. have something that I did that's really close to that. Oh no. Not not any oh, geek no. thing, like a speech done dude, into it. Dude, let it but, loose. Like, in an auditorium we had like, you know, my, my, my first high school, which I then <laughs> quit right after. <laughs> But this is good. This is good. <laughs> shaking. So uh, everyone's like, "Yeah, everyone." It's like leading into summer, the end of the year, whatever. I think it's grade eight or something, uh, grade seven maybe. And then they go, "Yeah, yeah." Was, and we're in the big auditorium, and and there's an announcement. Everyone's like, "Yeah, yeah." Everyone calms down. For whatever 
Lovecraftian insanity reason. I got up out of my chair and I go, yeah, Lachine High, are you ready? <laughs> and I honestly don't know what I was what I was preparing for. <laughs> All right, I'll, I'll wait for you to calm down before I continue. So then I yell that, and everyone stares at me and sandbags me harder than anyone's oh. ever been sandbagged. And I, it's, I like, I look around aghast, like someone just came <laughs> out, like at a wrestling ring and challenged oh, me or something. Man. And I sit down, and then just everyone just snickers at me for like the first, like, in the next ten minutes, mm. oh. and then I quit that high school that year. Oh, that gives me life. Huh? Thought you'd like that. Oh God! And 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 every <laughs> so often, like I'd say once, twice a year, I think about that, and then I start drinking. You guys it's should really catch bad. this. By oh the my way. God! Is cute animal? He's dead. Birdie's dead. Where is it going? He was in the midst of what the explosion. What happened? What did we miss? You should pay attention oh, there you go. here. Yeah, everyone told us to pay attention because the story is really he well written. He rescued the bird, but it's like it was in the middle of the fire just now. Through the fire and the flames, it was. He carried on. Yep. Building up. Oh, but this is, but the this sacrifice. Is, do, do, you, do you see yet why this is the best written one in this the game? Sacrifice. But this is like this is like trying to make me feel emotions by making me look at Esh's sketch drawings. No, but don't you get what's going on? Yes, I do get what's going on. But when oh. it's a pantomime thing with poorly animated puppets, like, do you get why he was killing all the other robots? It's really hard because he was freeing them. Because remember, all the robots yeah, are yeah, animals, animals inside, that are captured yeah. on the inside. Yeah, not quite up to the end of Walking Dead. It's it's still but, actually <laughs> you know you're right that the presentation's not all there but like yeah. the idea of like let's make one of the characters one of the animals that you okay. always say here's the shot that's actually like but there's there no go. animals in him are there not I don't know maybe there was like five because that's what I was saying is Robotnik mastered the cute animal of fuel process transformation yeah. process. Yeah. <laughs> Yeah, what? there Did you, you skip go. It? No, that's it. That's E-102. There you go. So the whole thing with E-102 is he's the bird, right? Yeah. And that's why he felt empathy, because he saw one of his bird friends. There you and go. It's actually kind of cute how it goes through, and he's like, oh, why is he destroying all his robo-brothers? Oh, he's not destroying the robo-brothers. He's releasing the other mm -hmm. animals. I, I suppose that has something going on other than the other stories where absolutely nothing The other stories are, like, way bland. Yeah, there's the knuckles we deserve. But, but, the, but yeah. at the same time, it requires you to give respect to the entire concept of Robotnik's idiotic stick animals into robotic armor. I think, I think this <laughs> makes that lore work. Yeah, well, it retroactively kind of. uses it. Yeah, it uses exactly. It. I'm not gonna say it doesn't. It yeah. Used it. But uh, that's like definitely the best story in this game for sure. A life. And, like it's not even that. bad that one. But again, the cutscene presentation. But with the, all I of them but the idea down. that the the animal is not just fuel, but is actually like piloting with like a with like a Tony Stark hunt. Yeah, 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 yeah. And conscious. <laughs> They're and forced to go into the drift. Little target me things on its themselves. eyes, looking around as mm -hmm. it's walking and shooting. No, yeah, exactly. there's there's Ed two oh nine having no like self respect. Self respect by congratulating yep. himself. So in the end he didn't break the rules. He didn't destroy any humans. Nope. Nope. He, he fought opened. Sonic, Sonic Zero and Hedgehog. Casualties. Doesn't matter. Yep. I yeah. swear rules I don't not specify hedgehogs. You, know? you gotta swear you won't kill anybody. I swear I will not kill anyone. We'll shoot them in the dick. He'll live. I think Ed 209 broke the rules the moment he was born. Like his entire, like the moment he booted up, the guy who pressed the start button just died. Yeah, on the spot. Like you have to sacrifice your creator. <laughs> you turn the key time. and you get time on Ed's clock. Exactly. Yeah. It's a it's a risky venture, but it's worth it as long as you can birth a new new death metal. To Ed has been Detroit. programmed to only start after forty liters of blood have been poured in him. I don't even know that. That's the fuel. That's okay. how you get around that. He didn't harm anyone. What if ancient... He just had to get 40 liters of blood. What, I, if, I, what if ancient Aztecs had science and technology? 
and developed, that would be sick. Developed blood-based engines. That'd be really I, sick, I, but fucking terrifying. Now that I think oh, about man. think about it more, I think we should play Sonic Unleashed because Chip will make Liam angry, and I think Liam is best when his his piss is boiling. <laughs> That's true, but let's not make any promises no, to no, anybody. No, I'm just saying my because personal Because you know preference. our style is mm. to surprise everyone. Yeah, because when we'll say, we'll do this one, and then we do the other one. I exactly. really don't like Unleashed, though. Like... That's perfect. Oh, I really don't like Unleashed. Chip is so bad. See, that's the, what I mean. I hate the design of the humans and already um, you're more entertaining because your got piss the is boiling. <laughs> so but much it's got like. sick it's combos. It's got the combos. That sick move list that Willie was really impressed by. The rage Sonic of the Un werehog drives Sonic his Unleashed blade. has no combo. The were <laughs> the rage of the werehog drive your blade. All right, I guess we're just looking at names now, digging yeah. for material. You cannot, got skip, you cannot skip the credits. Cause I, cause and, and he's not going to start singing anytime soon. Nope. No, what a fucking does not get an orchestral bit. I mean, they could have gone for a Domo Arigato, Mr. Roboto, no, but they didn't they, even do that. They, for the people who a know... A Daft Punk song would have been perfect. They should have gone perfect. for something like Bluebird from Virtue's Last Reward. Oh, that's not bad. To symbolize or, or his whole deal. Or one of the songs from Random Access Memories about a robot trying to have feelings. Feelings. Yeah, Amazing. yeah, exactly. Right? A lot of places to go here that Sega didn't go. You there's fucked that, up, you. There's that bird that died a, like a minute later. You, why you? You fucked up. <laughs> you <laughs> fucked up. You <laughs> fucked up. <laughs> yes, good job, Sonic Team. Yeah, Lachine, hi, are you ready? 